Single cell protein, process, applications, and benefits. Single cell protein are dried microbial cells or total protein, extracted from pure or mixed cultures of microbes such as algae, yeasts, fungi, or bacteria. Used as a substitute for protein-rich foods, in human and as for animal feeds. Single cell proteins, have application in animal nutrition as, fattening calves, poultry, pigs, and fish breeding. In the foodstuffs area as, aroma carriers, vitamin carrier, emulsifying aids, and to improve the nutritive value of baked products, in soups, in ready-to-serve meals, in diet recipes and in the technical field as paper processing, leather processing, and as foam stabilizers. Microbes as single cell protein source. Average composition of the main groups of microorganisms and percent dry weight. Microbes and commercial use. Single cell protein production process. Single cell protein production process follows these steps. Microbial screening, choice of raw materials, process engineering, and process optimization technology development, economic consideration safety concerns. Microbial screening. Microbial screening is the first step in production process, suitable microbe which yields good amount of protein need to be selected. Microbial strains are collected from various habitats like soil, water, air, and or from other biological materials. Microbes are selected by various studies including mutagenesis and other genetic methods, sometimes wild types are also used. Choice of raw material. This part is little cumbersome and one need to focus, on the correct composition of carbon supplement, which yields higher biomass production in lesser time need to be analyzed. Various carbon sources are like wood waste, straw. Other food processing wastes are also can be tried to optimize higher biomass production. Substrates for single cell protein production can be subdivided into three categories. High energy sources. Example, natural gas, N-alkanes, gas oil, methanol, ethanol, acetic acid. Various wastes, example, molasses, sulfite waste liquor, milk, whey, fruit wastes, and renewable plant resources, example, sugar, starch, cellulose. Process Engineering The technical conditions of cultivation, for the optimized strains are done and all metabolic pathways and cell structures will be determined. Technology Development Technology development is the next step, where the adoption of the technical performance of the process, in order to make the production ready for use on the large technical scale. Economic factors. Energy consumption, cost of production are the important factor while going for large scale production phase, this need to be thoroughly analyzed and an energy efficient process need to be developed or else it will end up with loss. Safety demands and environmental protection. Since the SCP produced is for human consumption or for feeding animal safety of the product need to be tested. Certain microbes produces toxic compounds which can have determinal effect on humans and also for the environment, so the whole process should be monitored properly. Advantages of single cell protein. Advantages of using microbes, for large scale production of single cell proteins are. Single cell protein high protein and low fat content. Single cell proteins are good source of vitamin. It can be produced throughout the year. Generation time of microbes is less, they multiply rapidly building up the biomass, more the biomass more the protein source. Protein content is very high in dried biomass up to 85%. During the production of SCP biomass, certain microbes produce useful byproducts such as organic acids. Waste can be used as a source for carbon, for growing microbes thereby having advantage of environmental cleanup also. Doesn't require sophisticated lab setup. For algae and certain other microbes. High efficiency substrate conversion. Medicinal uses of spirulina. Following are the medicinal uses of spirulina. Disadvantages of single cell protein. Even though its single cell proteins have the above mentioned advantages, it has some disadvantages also, 
The major problem associated with the use of single cell proteins are Many microbes produce various toxic compounds, so consumption of such toxic can have serious effect on health of humans or in animals. Single cell protein diet supplements can pose allergic reaction. Consuming SCP, intaking higher amount of nucleic acids which can lead to gastrointestinal problems. Food grade SCP production is expensive, due to the need to maintain high level sterility conditions in the production facility.